the philosophy of self-discipline. Discipline is like a guiding light that helps people stay focused on their goals and make good choices in life. It's not just about punishment or rules, but about self-control and respect for one as, as self and the others. In simple terms, discipline is about doing the right thing, even when it's hard. Firstly, discipline is essential for achieving success. Imagine trying to build a house without following plan or sticking to a schedule. It would be chaotic and probably wouldn't turn out well. Similarly, in life, discipline provides structure and direction. It helps people set goals, make plans and take the necessary steps to achieve them. Whenever it's studying, for example, practicing a sport or pushing a career, discipline is the key to making progress and reaching one full potential. Secondary, discipline fosters self-control and responsibility. When people are disciplined, they are learn to manage their impulses and make thoughtful decisions instead of giving in to the temptation of our procrastination. They stay focused on what's important. This self-control is crucial for overcoming obstacles and staying on track, even when faced with challenges or setbacks. Moreover, discipline teaches us responsibility by showing the action have consequences. When people take ownership of their choices and their outcomes, they learn valuable lessons that help them grow and mature. Furthermore, discipline promotes respect and harmony in society. In a world where everyone does as they please without regards for others, chaos would resign. Discipline encourages people to consider the needs and rights of others, fostering empathy and cooperation. Whenever it's following traffic rules, respecting property, or adhering to social natural norms, discipline helps maintain order and civility in communities. However, discipline doesn't mean being rigid or inflexible. It's important to find a balance between structure and flexibility, allowing room for creativity and spontaneity. Moreover, discipline should be accompanied by compassion and understanding. Everyone makes a mistake and discipline shouldn't be about guiding those and supporting people to learn from them rather than simply punishing them. In conclusion, the philosophy of discipline is about more than just rules and punishment. It's about self-control and responsibility, respect and harmony. By embracing discipline in our lives, we can achieve our goals, grow as individuals and contribute to a better world. So let's strive to be disciplined, not because we have to, but because it's the right thing to do.